Why, hello everyone! Welcome! Welcome back to Playframe and Dark Souls 2 Co-op, the finale. The finale. Yeah! We're back in our thumbnail gear. Yeah! Because <laughs> it felt appropriate. Look at you, looking good. Who would have thought? <laughs> oh, I'm excited. Do we need to talk to her again? Uh, not really. I don't think I need to talk to her again. Many if you want to, like, catch up, you know. It has been a while. Their Lord I assure you, my queen, we actually have been busy. Yeah, you got a whole bunch of knights downstairs. Yeah. And we beat a buff cat, and no one can prove we didn't. We totally did. Can't prove it. No, she knows. She she saw. Yeah. She's like, good job dispensing of buff cats. You have no idea how tired I was getting of having those buff cats out there. You've done me a solid. Thank you. Hey, knights, y'all ready for fights? Night fights, 2020? Night fights. Night fights. All, All right. right. Here we go. First try. First, tr I actually assume yes. And uh, <laughs> this has got to be like the most spectacle in a Dark Souls boss, right? It's real good. Because look at this. Boom. You're like, okay, falling into a pit. And then, bed of chaos. <laughs> bed of chaos. And there's a bunch of knights dropping in with you. And they just have a, an all-out actual battle. <laughs> yeah. Really, really cool designed fight. And then the king has like a proper WWE entrance. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the better be. <laughs> it's the ivory king. <laughs> okay, yeah, these guys don't care about hexes. They all. sure don't care about the queen either. Really? I mean... Sturdy folk, huh? Everyone kind of cares about the queen, but they they, they don't... You can't completely really care not about care about the queen. Yeah. It's the queen. Yeah, I got some charred loist stuff. Ow! So, on one playthrough, I, I, I managed to do it. Um, these guys have a chance to drop a loist soul. Oh, yeah? Um, and I think you need like 40 or something to get a, a sword from the uh, the queen. Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, I got a loiso. Hey, nice. <laughs> One drop for me. <laughs> um, and it's cool because the sword actually uh, heals when you hit, so you can heal allies by hitting them. Oh, that's cool. So I, I got that one playthrough, and then I was like, I'm never doing this again. <laughs> <laughs> How long did it take? Uh, a lot. I probably did this fight, like, over 50 times. Ooh, boy. And it, and it was just this, like, I would... Because you can come down here and fight these after the boss. Oh, yeah? I didn't know that. That's cool. I'm pretty sure. Hey, another light soul. <laughs> and I got a helm. Maybe... Maybe being a, a helper it helps the spawns. Could be. But yeah, look at this. <laughs> are you a, uh, hey, uh, night friend, you gonna seal this bad boy up? Or are you night gonna friend? just wait for no. one more to spawn? Maybe I wonder if co-op rules uh, affect how many of those get sealed up. Nah. I think they're just being lazy. Yep, here he goes. <laughs> He's just being lazy. Come on, knight. You have literally one job. We let you out of jail for this. Yeah. Ow. Boy, sturdy fellow. Hey, you cast spells at me. I do the spell casting around here. Goodness, I'm doing no damage to this fool. Okay, he's dead. Okay, that's a little better damage. Can focus on the big guy. Still only like 130 per cast. Maybe he cares about fog. Do you like my fog? I'm gonna go with no. Odds are not great. 
gosh, I love this fight. Even if you don't care about my fog. What about my Whisper of Despair? Do you at least... I don't know if it worked. Stop it. We're getting him. We're getting him! Ow. Well, how did that hit me? Don't hit me with your light beam sword. He's coming. Or Ow. Boy, I hope I don't die. What are you saying? <laughs> Nothing. Man, we were supposed to first try that. We were supposed to first try. Now when we drop down, all the knights are going to be like, this guy. Oh, this guy again. <laughs> <sighs> These two clowns. <laughs> That's all right. It's appropriate for the finale. It'd feel weird if we get it, got it all perfectly. Yeah. Listen, Queen, I don't want to hear any snark. <laughs> oh, I see you're back, and my problem hasn't been resolved. Our best is what we're doing. Hmm. Pity. <laughs> <laughs> and just think, not two weeks ago, you were coming in here saying, Ah, oh, we can just go fight the king. We don't need the knights. Yeah, we, we got this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I kind of feel like we need the knights. <laughs> no? no you're not, you're not with me on that one? No, I really feel like having knights actually helped a great deal. I mean, I guess. They perform a valuable service by turning into ice in front of a door. Do we have to tip? <laughs> the knights? Yeah. We can never... Or you alternate the ice first and then tip after. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That checks out. I feel like they totally designed this arena and they were like, all right, four portals, gonna spawn in guys, and they're like, four's maybe too much. Let's do three. <laughs> <laughs> come on, knights. Get, oh, come on. Oh, that was somebody else hitting me. Okay, sorry, I got confused for a second there. I guess this fight took me a good few tries in my original playthrough also. Whoa! Knights, chill. Ch Ni whoa! Knights have no chill. Oh, I was not being careful enough though, I wasn't getting like enough distance. You silly goof. Yeah, that one was genuinely my bad. Not like all those other times where it was the game's fault mm -hmm. for cheating. This <laughs> time, I will accept blame. A lot. But never again. Henceforth, I shall be blameless and perfect. I'm just gonna sip my coffee over here. <laughs> I feel mm. like you're not buying this whole blameless and perfect thing. Uh, no, I, I'm so proud of you, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> I've got like 20 of these old growth balms which raise my strength i wonder how many i can eat <laughs> <laughs> you know this is the finale what's yeah what, like what are some consumables we can just like chomp for the heck of it crimson water that seems pretty good oh. what on earth i had my controller sitting on my desk <laughs> <laughs> sounded like someone was like revving up a chainsaw in there <laughs> Pretty much the same thing. <laughs> Got holy water urns. Hexing urns. Apparently I can eat a few. They definitely won't care about that. Yeah, I should go start this fight. I'm very curious to see what your damage starts looking like. I don't know. Just keep beating them, though. <laughs> <laughs> something, something will happen, right? Yep. It's good for you. Mmm, old growth. Good for healthy bones.
All right, this time. This time. Is the damage difference noticeable? Uh, no. <laughs> I haven't, let me, let me get a hit that I know the number of. Yeah, no, it's about the same. Huh, bummer. Maybe it wore off too fast. Damn. That's true. Let's eat more. <laughs> Problem is, it didn't eat enough. No, it seems like the same. <laughs> well, fooey. I'm doing like nothing to these fools. And I don't feel like my fire sword's gonna do much better. <laughs> I guess if I had packed a different spell. <laughs> yeah, fire sword, probably not ideal. If I die again, which I won't, so there's no point in even saying it, but if I do, I'm gonna come in here with a different spell, y'all. It's the finale. I'm gonna give y'all something special. By casting another spell. Big claim. No, I'm gonna do it, just watch. Pretty bold strat. Let's see if it pays off. <laughs> Cut it out, knight. There we go. Alrighty. Ow. Knight's no. Knight's no. Dog on it. Stop it. I'm trying to heal. Trying to imagine this, uh, this boss fight as mm -hmm. a, a no-hit run. I mean, someone's done it. <laughs> but I, I, I can't. Don't know, I don't know if all all bosses for Dark Souls Two have been done uh, no-hit. So, so I'm didn't sure do... someone has, but. Well, I don't blame him for not doing all bosses when he was doing that like no-hit yeah. series because that's just stupid. But someone has to have done this. Yeah, surely. If not, it's being worked on. <laughs> <laughs> We're on the case. <laughs> Darn, that's cool. Zaps. Oh, oh, you put some lightning on it. Yeah, get some lightning on the queen. Yeah. What other knight? Get out of here. Ouchies. Okay, other knight has been taken care of. Fantastic. Yeah, nice soul. <laughs> wow, you got like three of them. Nope. Zaps. Zaps. You do a little buff. Yeah, there you go. Ow. <laughs> the buff hurts. Oh, explosion. Oh, hey, good work, Knight. Staggered him. Thanks, Knight, and goodbye. <laughs> oh. You did good. No! Oh, hey, this again. Well, at least I'm at full health this time. So, that's better. This old thing. <laughs> I disagree. <laughs> there you go. See? Yeah. Gotta, I gotta follow your lead. Yeah, and my pro abilities. These are the top tier skills that defeated Buff Cat. Yeah. Only you guys got to see it, man. It was it was really something. It really was. Hey, can you kill him before I die? Bam! Hey, I zapped you. I zapped you. Shenanigans. Don't die. I'm trying not to. Could you kill him, maybe? Thank there you. you. <laughs> <laughs> really did me a solid there. <laughs> uh, Duty fulfilled. We've done the darn thing. We've gotten all the dang crowns. Or almost. I guess I have to go upstairs to get the crown, huh? Uh, yeah, right? Oh, no, wait. It's over here. Is it somewhere? I can't remember. There we go. Here's the crown. Give to me crown. Thank you. Awesome. 
Only one left to fetch. I should wear this crown. You know what? Actually, I'll talk to her first. <laughs> that seems... Seems good. Seems more respectful. <laughs> Maybe don't wear his crown <laughs> until I'm out of eyesight. <laughs> Check out your dead husband's crown. <laughs> Guess what I successfully did. <laughs> You're welcome. You've grafted. I want you can thank me by paying me. <laughs> With this crown that I took. <laughs> Dude, I'd had this I'd had this thought of for a question to ask you in the middle of the fight and then got distracted by not dying. Uh mm -hmm. is there So like I've got some Dark Souls bosses that I've never beaten. And I got a couple other souls or like from game bosses that I have beaten but never like solo one on one. Do you have any Dark Souls bosses that you've either never beaten or never beaten, uh, been able to do, like, solo? Um... I think, uh... I, I've beaten them all, solo. The last one for me, though, was, um... Madir. Madir, Because yeah. I... The first, like, two times I fought him, I had to summon. I... Could not, and and then once I learned the strategy against him, I was like, oh okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think that was the one that held me up for a while, and then there was a few. Um, like Manus was one that I had just uh, never fought solo for a long time, and then I finally went back when a remaster came out. Oh yeah, and played through, and finally beat. Uh, I think Kalmi and Manus first time solo when Dang. remaster came out, so those were the those were the final. But yeah. I I think I I'm trying to think. I think so, because we, we did all the um Demon Souls stuff solo, right? Did I summon yeah. anything? think so. Oh, like, we couldn't, because there's no servers. So we... <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 right. We could not summon for anything. Uh, and then, yeah, we only like, kind of got online at the end just to get you out of yeah. the purest black tendency <laughs> hell. <laughs> Gosh, that part was not fun. I, I no. still feel bad that that ended up going that way. <laughs> uh, so, it was so rough. Because it was like a situation I knew I could do it, but I was also like, I can't slam my head into the wall anymore because... We're on a timetable. <laughs> yeah, like you you got a flight. <laughs> uh, yeah, that was that was rough, but you did it. Yeah, I think I did it. I'm going through Code Vein solo, and uh, I honestly think it's just not as fun solo. Oh yeah. Um, it definitely feels like they've built encounters specifically with co-op in mind. Ah, oh, I see. I've still, I only like played like 30 minutes of Code Vein. Yeah. The first, like, maybe two hours of it, I was trying to force it into something it wasn't because I was like, I'm playing it like a Dark Souls. And <laughs> By gosh, there, yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of that in there, but using the activated abilities is huge. And, and weirdly enough, I didn't like having a big weapon in that game. I like uh, a fast one-handed weapon. Huh. At some point, I do feel I should give that one a proper try, and Neo as well. Like, I don't think I'm going to like either of them as yeah. much as I do. I, I I really want to like Neo, and every time I try, I just am like, I'm not enjoying this. Hmm. Well, I don't know. I don't know what it is, if it's the uh, switching, like, stances or something like that. Uh, or maybe I just don't feel like there's good feedback for when I'm, like, actually hitting something. Yeah. I have to go back and actually think about why I'm frustrated with it. Or, or not getting gripped by it. I'm looking for dumb things to spend my money on. I think that's a good idea. Go out with a bang. Hmm. Where's another shop that I haven't killed? 
<laughs> yeah, who's... Let, let's give a rundown. NPCs in your world who remain. Actually, there's still a lot. Most of Majula is pretty much here. This isn't like, uh... My normal runs. <laughs> <laughs> weird. I know, weird. Like, so most everyone's still there who didn't make it. Um... Uh, uh, I can't remember his name. Kate? Kale? The cartographer? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh! Yeah, okay. His gravestone is here. I was like, wait, is he alive? Nope. His gravestone. <laughs> um, uh, the Crestfallen. Rip Crestfallen. Did I, did I kill Moglin? No, I didn't kill. Wow. That's surprising, even me. <laughs> Uh, I think just that's it. Oh, I killed the uh, the sorcerer guy. Because he was mean to me. <laughs> just cuz. Yeah. He was like, you're stupid. I don't care about talking to you. <laughs> killed him. And he brings nothing to the table, so like, nothing yeah. of value was lost. Nope. Nothing of value. There have been... 362 million deaths worldwide. Wow. It's a lot of Dark Souls. And only like a third of those can be blamed on me. Yeah. <laughs> you can view half of those on Playframe. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It is Vendrick time. May nothing go bad. He got a lot of health. He do got a lot of health. Hopefully less, since I've done some giant defeating work. I doubt he cares about fog either. Is he mad at me yet? You know, you raised a good point. I should, I should clear out this. Anyway, it's getting a little crowded here. <laughs> What do you what what do you got, Gilligan? Anything I want? Yeah, give me a play by play here. I'm gonna buy some of the uh, bleeding stuff for fun. I have bad news. You it went well? Yep. First try every time. Oh, that's good. Easy. If anything, this finale is going too smoothly. <laughs> <laughs> Gilligan will pay the price. <laughs> Tough break, Gilligan. A ladder miniature. My inventory bag is full. I've never seen that. What? That can happen? I'm sorry, Dark Souls. What? What are you talking about, Dark Souls? That's not. That can't happen. I. I granted, I have every like boss soul that I haven't popped. Still though. Inventory bag is full. It's still full. What what do I have? I, I mean I have a lot of weapons. Guess it could be that. But but not too many. <laughs> <laughs> Never too many. Yeah. I don't wanna I don't wanna get rid of anything. I can't believe that's a message that exists. Yeah, I didn't know there was a limit. Ah! Okay. Turns out if you've already started attacking Vendrick, then if you run into his room again, he is ready for you. He never forgives. He does not. I'm just going to start using a bunch of these, like, resist elemental things that I never used. Yeah. Let's see if that clears up inventory slots. <laughs> no! Still will not let me. What do you mean? Huh. Do I have a duplicate weapon? Yes. Let's drop this club. Let's drop a dragon tooth. It's got so much health. Is it because I already have the ladder miniature? Oh, could that be it? That like it's an item that you just can't have more of that? Maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna try dropping that. Because I have a key as a key item. Yep, that was it. Okay, so that makes more sense. Weird, they they should have said other message. 
<laughs> okay, you can't kill the cat. Who else we got? Who's lurking around here? Oh, did I ever kill the uh, cleric lady? I think I did already. I think this playthrough has taught me one thing. It's that yes. cats are immortal. Cats are immortal. Fact. Except for the buff cat, which we did beat. Yeah. Eventually. It was difficult, though. Right comments? Y'all know. Right. <laughs> Come on, Vendrick. Stop having all the health. It's not fair for you to have this much. You gotta leave some for other people. Rosabeth the Pyromancer? More like Rosabeth the Dead. <laughs> Got her. <laughs> <laughs> Well done. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Vandrak. Stone Trader Cloane, more like... <laughs> I got nothing. <laughs> more like, you're also dead. <laughs> what do you drop? Nothing? Oh, something. Hailstone. Lenigrast, more like Lenigon. <laughs> you get better at this. Mm-hmm. I'm learning. I got a hammer. Rats. You won? Didn't realize he could do a follow-up attack there. Boo. Boo and hiss. Malentia the hag lives another day. <laughs> <laughs> I bought her some time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, Vendrick. You asked for it. It's time for my ultimate attack. <laughs> Summon Lady Jingle. Go, Lady Jingle! You're in trouble now. See, actually, that's the class I've been playing this whole time, in fact, is a summoner. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Pokemon trainer. Yeah. What type of Pokemon Lady Jingle? Probably dark, right? Dark steel. Ooh. That's, uh, the same typing as one of my favorite Pokemon. It is? Which one? Yeah, uh, Bisharp. I don't know that one. Um, Gen 5, he's got like blades on his arms and a bunch of like metal razors all over him. Ooh. He's real cool looking. Neat. Ponyard's evolution. I am wondering if this will actually work. Oh, nope. nope. It just kicked me out. All right. Looks like I have to actually get good for reals though. So be it. So be it. So you choose death. <laughs> Quite possibly and very likely. Carrie, cut ahead to when I win. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, do you think the Emerald Herald can take a hit from the Queen? I bet so. She seems sturdy. Let's find out. She can. She lives. Hey. Good on you, Herald. <laughs> Malentia, though. Can you survive the Queen? I don't know why this never occurred to me. Like, there's someone named Herald. It's like, hi, I'm Emerald Herald. <laughs> Hey! It's me, Harold. Emerald. Uh, the hag did not survive a hit from the queen. Yeah, she was up there in years. Yeah. How about Marlin? Takes some vitality to survive a visit from the queen. Oh, he survived a hit, but not a second. <laughs> well, Marlin, you should be commended for being able to survive the one, though. You know, not everyone can. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's pretty quiet here. Well, that sounds nice. Yeah. No annoying blacksmith making <laughs> a racket. No people minding their own business. Finally. <laughs> Peace and quiet. <laughs> Just you and your thoughts. A lot of gravestones. <laughs> Takes so long to kill. I believe in you. As I yawn. <laughs> I didn't mean for those two things to line up like that. It was absolutely the appropriate combination for this battle. <laughs> <laughs> ah, come on. I don't know why the roll didn't work. How close were you? Uh, only like two thirds through his health. It like every single hit only hits him for like 130 maybe. Ah. Uh. Which is not helping. Oof. I'm going to try, you know what? for funsies. 
some other spells. We'll see if other spells do anything. What kind of magic's gonna work best against a Vendrick? Um, like it could be fire. I would bet lightning. Lightning could be good too, yeah. Do I have a lightning I can cast? Sunlight blade, that's kind of cool. Let me check the uh, the deep, uh, dark corners of my mind to see what I think would, you know, hmm. Let me really ponder this. Yeah, really get into those recesses of your memory. Let's see. Okay, when I I fought him ages ago, mm -hmm. it seemed like um, <laughs> pure magic did good against him. Just straight up magic, huh? Okay. Mm hmm. You're sure you remember in that clearly? Mm hmm. <laughs> Good get a look at Soul Greatsword. I think I can cast that now. Uh, sorcery that attacks foes using a sword made of souls. Energy is focused at a single point, wielded as a sword in both hands. Not too dissimilar to sword play and so inherently endangers the caster. I'm kind of in danger anyway, but thanks for the consideration, game. I appreciate that you're looking out for my safety. So, uh, while, while you're doing that, uh -huh. I'm just going to talk with the play friends here. Yeah, please do. Um, We've, I feel like we've mentioned, I know we've mentioned you going, uh, big heavy weapons for Dark Souls 3 when we, whenever we get to it. Yes. Um, but the build I'm going for, I'm very excited because it's two things, uh, I'm excited about with Dark Souls 3. I'm going for an arcane archer build. Arcane archer. So I'm going to, I'm going to start the game probably with just bow and arrow and just going pure, pure bow and arrow. Ooh. I like that. Um, because the, uh, since there's the sword art or the weapon arts, uh -huh. some of the, some of the bows actually have, like, fun things like a multi-shot or, like, a powerful uh, piercing shot and stuff like that. Cool. Uh, and then do a few little spells here and there just for some, uh, extra coverage, but I'm real excited. That sounds great. I haven't really played with any bows in Dark Souls 3, so. It sounded like 3 is when bows, like, started actually being fun. Yeah. I think they actually became like a viable weapon that's not. Hey, my message got raided. Nice. Uh, that's not just for, you know, like sniping difficult enemies to deal with on your run. Because I feel like that's what most bow usage gets in uh, Dark Souls. Yeah. Ow. Gracious. Uh, I just chose a bad time to heal. Yep. And I paid for it. But the, uh, the. Magic weapon on a different sword is actually doing a whole lot better for me. Good. Nice. So if I were to give a review to sort of a melee hex build currently, I don't think I'd rate it super high <laughs> at the end of the no. day. I'm also not playing super well, so... There is that also. But, uh, end game, especially... Oh, wow, so that's how that works. That's kind of cool. It's just like a one-time swing, and it doesn't do a whole lot of damage, so okay, I won't do that anymore. And I don't want to try to verbally explain it while I'm in the middle of the fight, so you'll just mm -hmm. have to see it later. <laughs> All right. Soul Greatsword looks cool, but it's not a sort of thing that I want to regularly use, I don't think. Damn. Yeah, reach? it seemed like uh, your your build, you were, you were having fun with it at certain points, and then I think once the health pool and resistances increased yeah. on bosses and enemies, it, it kind of became a, a slog. That's, yeah, that's really what did it. Early on, it was, like, especially in mid-game, it was looking very strong. I was al I was almost keeping up with you. Yeah, you you hit a point where you were way out damaging me. But then, um, like, yeah, as soon as we started getting into DLC stuff, resistance has really started hurting me. I'm, I have bad lighting right now, so hang on, let me go back to Majula Bahama come. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I just thought of that. <laughs> that was really good. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, man. Close. I was really close, yeah. Or closer. I look like, I get I get in a good rhythm with him, but uh, as soon as I get near a wall, I kind of have to pull away so I can keep circling around, and then he throws mm -hmm. in, starts pulling out a couple of moves that I've not been, like, uh, habit dodging. <laughs> right, right. Yeah, yeah, so. Bleh. Ooh. 
Mm-hmm. I'm gonna infuse the queen with raw damage. Sounds real good. Sounds like exactly the right choice. Come on, hit detection. Being flaky on me. Now's not the time. Come on. Finally! Gracious! Got him. That took too nice. darn long. Vedrick. So eager to cling to this life. <laughs> this situation you're in. <laughs> I'm gonna go take your crown. <laughs> BRB, Vendrick. It's pretty tough out there for us Hexers, Dan. Yeah? Yeah. I keep casting very good spells, and so many people keep not caring. Like, my fog? My fog's great. I don't know what they all have against my fog. Mm-hmm. But it's super awesome. I'm sure it is, Dan. And they keep ignoring it. Let's put your fog right on the fridge. <laughs> uh, there's so like in certain situations, it is legit incredible. Like I some of these Vendrick Knights, like I just they don't even come attack me. I just fog them and then they slowly die and don't do anything. It's great. And then there was the great dragon knight fight again. We can't for be forgetting that. Oh, yes. That was amazing. That sequence is, like, probably my favorite memory from this playthrough. <laughs> it was really good. But then all these other dorks didn't get the news. And my hexes and fog, especially, are the best. Yeah, no respect. No respect. No respect. I'm gonna die. Because oh. of the lack of respect, you see. I always like thinking about like an enemy's uh, day to day routine. Yeah. And, and, and the Shrine of Amana ones are like, what are they even doing? <laughs> It's true. What are they doing out here? Hanging out in water. Like, what a tough gig. Your feet are wet all day, every day. Yeah. And it's not like they're like barefoot. They're wearing like, like leather. Yeah, they're not even dressed for this sort of like aquatic environment. Yeah. It's a rough job. Like, are they are they pure, mindless husk kind of thing? Because. I feel like they still seem organized to some degree. Yeah. Mm. I mean, I'll admit to kind of mentally checking out at certain jobs. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just, uh, you just kind of stand around and you're... And you're there because you need to be, but... Oh, I guess I already took this night out. Good for me. Nice. If you ever needed any evidence that I'm just incredibly good at Dark Souls... Well, you've got plenty, but, uh... Here's one more to add to the list. I can't remember if that door is... You need to be hollow or human to enter it. Uh, it just opened for me. And I so, am human. There you go. <laughs> so, there's our answer. Because... Nishandra couldn't get it. Yeah. And they got all the king's stuff, so thank goodness. That's handled, we did it! Finally! I can go back to Vendrick. Doggone it, hang on. Alright, Vendrick. It's time for you and I to have one more conversation. Please make my crown good. I'm really excited to get this ending, Vendrick. I haven't gotten it before. Seeker of fire. Darn, I love his voice. Of mm -hmm. What do you see in the flames? Find the crowns and your own answers. The crowns hold the strength of lords from times long past. Seek adversity. As befits you, seeker of fire.
coveter of the throne. Done and done. <laughs> Seeker of fire, conqueror of dark. I too sought fire once. With fire, they say, a true king can harness the curse. A lie, but I knew no better. Seeker of fire, you know not the depth of dark within you. It grows deeper still, the more flame you covet. Flame, oh, flame. Seeker of fire, I see you've subdued another foul creature. One of the father of the abyss spawn. That confounded quintessence of humanity. I see someone's been reading the thesaurus. But then it dissipated. <laughs> and yet, traces of its existence... What did uh, he go on about? Uh, confounded quintessence of humanity. <laughs> ah, yes. Those are some good Scrabble words. <laughs> That'll get you some points. Yeah. A feeble, tiny thing that thirsted for power more than any other. Driven by insatiable lust. I've noticed I've it's happened a few times in like recent days yeah um we ever have that thing where like your inside or your throat or whatnot makes noise and you have your mouth open so it kind of like projects a little yeah <laughs> I keep noticing my my body doing that oh it's like what are these weird noises <laughs> Is it sort of like a burp, or is it just sort of like you're like yawning, stretching, and then there's sort of like a weird like, eh, or some sort of sound that comes out? Not e yeah, like, not even like a burp, but more just like... Hmm. Like, you know when... Someone, like, maybe more for like ASMR, when people are like really close to the mic, and you can hear like their... their lips separate from their teeth kind yep. of thing? Yep, yep, yep. Like, like that kind of stuff. Will follow. Yeah, that's not a sound that I enjoy. Like, like swallow, but your throat kind of is still readjusting, and then you're you open your mouth to go speak, but it like makes a little like, like yeah, <laughs> or kind of noise. I I very much love that that conversation is the one we were having <laughs> during <laughs> during this. <laughs> <laughs> it's in a game story. It's very good. I'm gonna come meet you and we're gonna beat Dark Souls. Oh my gosh. Woo! I'll be right there. The time has come to put an end to this. Hey, Knight. I said the time has come to. Knight, we're doing a thing. You know what? You get fog. Because you're one of the only fans of it. At least someone appreciates my fog. <sighs> At least someone. Not a lot of fog fans out there. But okay. Produce the symbol of the king. I will. Just let me crunch on this life gem real fast and then I'll... Okay. The symbol of the king. Uh, this one. Let's see. Where is it? I know I have it in my purse here somewhere. There's the one. Open up. Oh, I need to wear my crown. What am I doing? I worked so hard for it. Mm hmm. Crown of the Ivory King. Crown of the Sunken King. Crown of the Iron King. King's Crown. Which is, I think, the one. Mm-hmm. Just triple checking. I have so many crowns, <laughs> you see. We've collected a lot. This ivory one really looks the coolest. Yeah. I, I like them all, but I think the ivory one might be the coolest. Looks so nice. Anyway. Okay. Harold, how you doing? 
My journey is already complete. My name is Shanalot. The dragon gave me this name, for I was born with none. I was born of dragons, contrived by men. By ones who would cause him fate herself. They are the ones who created me. But they failed. I did not come out as intended. Fate would not be best, and men were cursed once again. If you proceed, Nashandra will come after you. Knowing that you will take the throne and link the fire. She covets the first flame and the great soul. Put Nashandra to rest. Yeah, don't worry. The Nashandra being put to rest thing will probably happen pretty fast. <laughs> We're a little over-leveled. We've been doing some DLCs. Also, we have a jingle. Oh. <laughs> there you is. Dressed to impress. Oh, yeah. Looking awesome. Looking cool. Very. I would keep equipping my sickle, but I'm guessing... <laughs> It's not gonna do great. So, uh. No? Against the being of. made of goopy dark? <laughs> I hate it, but it's true. My best moves, and no one appreciates them. Before we make it there, I wanted to test this. Yeah. Oh, right, yes. I wanna see. It's a box. It's, it's just a box. You're a box. Welcome back, Boxy. <laughs> <laughs> Right. It was worth a try. If if we get another box, I'll, I'll give up. Uh oh! Oh, the mirror! The again. mirror! Okay. That's fun. I don't see my reflection. I like the mirror. I'll, I'll stay mirror. <laughs> Look into me. Ah. <laughs> We're ready. I have a good feeling. This is actually kind of hard to see the path. I'm gonna walk <laughs> off. <laughs> The final approach. We're doing it! I mean, this is a, a, a tall little arena. I've never actually looked up. Whoa. I can barely see the top up there. This is a cool space. Mm-hmm. Good on you, Dark Souls too. You got some rad stuff. Oh yeah, look at this. Look at the bleeding effect. It's like super fiery. That's very fiery. Right? Yeah, that seems... like it should be fire. You'd think. Oh, well. Macaroni and cheese. <laughs> All right, let's do the thing. Boy, have I got some bad news for y'all, watchers and defenders of the throne. You know, you're doing some good fast damage to him. I expected their poor health bars would go even faster at this point. I expected more, to be honest. I guess we gotta check and test what they think of fog. Literally nothing. No respect. My dork orbs are doing pretty good though. That's nice. That's good. It's been so long. Since anyone cared about my spells. Yeah. Stop it. No, no pokes. No pokes. Almost got the watcher. Almost got the defender. And Dunskies. Oh. Nice work. Hooray. We did it. We beat the game. We beat the game. <laughs> and there's Dark Souls 2, everybody. That's it. Thank you for watching. Weird that I haven't uh, been unsummoned yet. Hmm. Yeah, that's odd. Something, something must be wrong. Hmm. Wait a minute! What? Grave undead. You have proven yourself to me. Was it the buff cat thing? I bet it was the buff cat thing. It was the buff cat. Yeah. Definitely wasn't the Ventric fight. <laughs> Just 
so, Andros, you show your true form. <laughs> <laughs> Only I have the brains to rule Drang Lake. <laughs> now be one. I was so impressed with the animation of you know, Dark Souls in general, but like there's just such a unique cool quality to character and enemy animation. Like the slow speed is a part of it. Mm-hmm. But it's just so cool. Sorry, I can't really think of anything more descriptive right now. I'm casting my Dark Orbs, which are weirdly actually working. They're doing damage. That's good. Not a ton. They're doing some. Yeah, the Queen is not actually doing well against the Queen. You'd, you'd think Weird. the other way around. Lasers! Lasers! You know, I thought this crown was supposed to protect me from this nonsense. I'm wondering if I, like, did the whole thing and then didn't actually, like, pick up the finished crown or some nonsense. Whatever. Uh, you went into his memory, right? Yeah, I did. Yeah. Take magic sword. I believe it just makes when you, uh, when you die, you don't become, um, undead. You oh, stay really? human. That's cool. Okay. I thought for some reason that it, like, uh, got rid of the effect that these, that this health drain does, but... Oh, no, it, it, it keeps you from be getting cursed by it. That's right. The health still goes away, but I'm not getting more cursed by the effect. I get it. I guess I'll crunch oh. some life gems. Keep that health up. And once more, with feeling, have some fog. She killed me. What? Yeah. Impossible. I died. She really didn't like your queen sword thing. Wasn't a fan. Darn. Can't believe I died. <laughs> I can't either. It's really surprising. She, she, she got me in two hits with one laser. Ow. I might die, actually. Which is surprising. But it's kind of par for the course for how I've been the last few episodes. Ah. We're beating it, no matter what. We're beating it. We have to, Dan. We called okay. it that this was the finale. We have to See, actually do it, though. I, I appreciate you intentionally dying so I could take part in the final fight. Thank you, Dan. That was very kind of you. It was a bit of a sacrifice, but one I'm willing to make for a friend. It's very kind. All right, I'm switching it up. <laughs> People watch this for some reason. I've been told. <laughs> Lord knows I don't see the appeal. Just like two guys playing games talking to each other. <laughs> <laughs> One of them's not even that good. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, serious faces, though. Indeed. I'm ready to do serious faces. I'm ready. I'm pumped. Yes. I am also that. I blame my weapon. That's, uh, that's what I blame on. I, too, blame your weapon. <laughs> I also do that. <laughs> your weapon's been holding you back. Yeah. Keeping you from ascending to your true power. I had to let go of the queen. That's what this whole message is about. You gotta... <laughs> you gotta let go. The queen is... Just playing with you. You're a pawn. Yeah, you just can't keep clinging to the queen. And I like what you switched it up for. Yes. This feels very good. My, um... I went with the, uh, movie box art colors. <laughs> <laughs> it's very good. I hope you restocked on repair powders. <laughs> I didn't. Oh yeah, now we get the version where she's still in here too. Cool. Oh, cool. Back so soon. It's been two times. <laughs> yeah, okay, Nishandra, you don't have to be sarcastic with we've proven ourselves to you <laughs> nonsense now. Yeah. We know how we, it went. We did the work, okay? Yeah. Also, we know you just killed us, so, like, don't get sassy with me. 
we do anything to destroy these? I don't think we can, can we? Nah. That's a bummer. Oh, yeah. That attack did like 200 more damage. Or can we? We can. We can make it go away. I didn't know that. Cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Come over to me. Away from your things. That would have made the fight a lot easier, actually. In retrospect. Because apps. Yeah, these do actually pretty good damage. More than a lot of my other nonsense. Still going to try some other nonsense, though. Hack and slash! Stop. Stop following me. Hey, pay attention to me, Stop. maybe, huh? I'm also interesting. Hey! Hey! Kind of feeling ignored over here, Nashandra. Nash Nashandra? He's just treating me like a little chihuahua at her heels. Mm hmm. Okay, there you go. I'm also cool and important. Look at my crown. And. Bzzzy. Yeah! Wait, wait. Final attack. There you go. <laughs> yes! Oh, that looks so cool! <laughs> oh, the. This red and blue explosion. I love it. Oh, good. We finally beat the game now. At the last. Dark, they wouldn't have put three bosses back to back. Surely not. One round of poison. Um, I'm going to switch back to the queen, though, because fire, I don't think, is a good idea. You know, you may be onto something. Not one of them. <gasps> you know what I'm switching to? Huh. As you do. Now. <gasps> yes! You. The old ways. The old ways. Your Get pumped! Where? <laughs> he snuck up on us. He sure did. Hey, Aldia. So dark orbs do... Oh, you're not taking damage yet. Dark orbs do bad. Dark fog? No one probably cares. Nope. No one cares. Wow, my other attacks do almost nothing, too. Sturdy fellow. Not comfortable with how long this spell is charging. Ah! <laughs> what are you doing over there? Okay. Where is he? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, now can we do damage? Was that the problem? Yeah. Oh, that was the problem. Okay. So you just get a limited no. window to do damage, and then he gets all buffed up. Ew. Gracious me. Heal quick before he does a huge explodey. Come on. I can probably attack him right now, but... Ow. I'm too busy getting hit. No time to attack, Dan. And then he'll pop up, do a little explosion. There you go. Dark orb! Dark orb! Alright. Boy, a tiny window. Yeah. Not great. Bro! Really doesn't like you. Really doesn't. He doesn't really care so much for me. You know what? Frankly, it's just nice having someone pay attention. Nishandra just ignored me so much. Yeah. Oh, explosion. Ow. Uh, dude. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of missed my window on that one. Guess let's just get great magic weapon going some more. And I'll try to take advantage of the windows I can get. Here we go, and get in there. Yeah, there's a way to do it. Bit by bit. Bit by bit. So I like the, okay, so his fire does go away for like short little bits after attacks. That's nice. Mm-hmm. I, I think like. when he charges his big one too, goes away. Yeah, yeah, you got a nice big opening then. Whoa. Not a that long opening fast. that time. Yeah, that was a very tiny window. 
Yeah. Don't like it. Boy, I'm glad I used that healing item. Me too. Aldia, come on. Let us hit you. Hit by a bit. <laughs> you explode? Oh, big fire. Big fire. Now he's gonna do a thing. I'm gonna hit him a couple times. Okay. What's it going for? Probably me, I think. Uh, yep. Yep. Oh, ho, 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 ho. it hurts a lot, huh? <laughs> that was my experience. I an idea. Don't be that way. I'm using all my divine blessings because I realized I went into this fight with two Estes on Nashandra. <laughs> oh, yikes. <laughs> Yes. Do the damage. Kill! On the way! Oh, that's the tracking one. I bet we got him next time. It's coming for... I couldn't tell who that was coming for. <laughs> kind of split his attention, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. That's kind of cool. Okay, yes. Yeah! Nice! Look we at us! We did it! Competence! We finally achieved it. Or I did. Lady Jingle, thank you for all of your help. Thank you, Dan, for joining me on this journey. Yeah, Aldia, we're kind of having a moment. Okay. Yeah, Aldia. All right. Last time, with the original playthrough, y'all remember that I went for the throne? This time, no. This time, we're gonna go back out into the world and seek a new solution. Which is the ending I like most. Yeah, th this ending, the story that the DLCs cumulatively tell leading up to this particular ending, I think is what makes me like Dark Souls 2 so much. Yeah. Like, uh... Like, without the DLCs additions, yeah, I, I kind of agree with most that Dark Souls 2 is sort of like the weaker of the pack. Uh, but Dark Souls 2, with what the DLCs add, is a force to be reckoned with. Yeah. For sure. By the way, if you all have enjoyed this and you want to support us making more things here at Playframe, we have a Patreon. And uh, the more patrons we get, the more like bonus series and playthroughs and videos we make. But even if you don't want to support us on Patreon, thank you very much for watching. And if you want to watch Dan Jones playing more things, particularly if you want more Dan playing Dark Souls 2, because now he's finally able to go out there <laughs> and uh, <laughs> do his randomizer run of this thing. If y'all want to see that, then go subscribe to twitch.tv slash because I'm Dan Jones. Is that right? Yeah. It's on screen it. and it's also down in the description. So go watch Dan stream things. He streams a lot of good stuff. Thanks. <laughs> we should sign off somewhere though. Let, let me meet you somewhere and then let's uh let's end this episode proper. All right. Yeah, this is great. <laughs> awesome. Good.
Yeah, ah, oh, yeah, this is awesome. All right, y'all. It is finally time for us to sign off and put a bow on Dark Souls 2 over here. Thank you all so very much for watching this. I hope you've enjoyed it, and uh, we will be back uh, next week. Not necessarily with another uh, Souls game. Bloodborne will come a little later. We'll get to that. we got some other stuff we're going to do first. I hope y'all look forward to that and enjoy it, and uh, I'm rambling now. So, <laughs> y'all have yourselves a good one, and I'll see you later. Goodbye. Goodbye, everyone.